Welcome to the HCM Technology News Roundup. It's January 11th, 2021, and I'm Mark Pfeffer, editor of the HCM Technology Report, bringing you the latest news on HR technology. And it's brought to you by NetSuite. If you're a business owner, you don't need me to tell you that running a business is tough, but you might be making it harder on yourself than you have to. Don't let QuickBooks and spreadsheets slow you down anymore. It's time to upgrade to NetSuite. NetSuite gives you visibility and control over your financials, HR, inventory, e-commerce, and more. Everything you need, all in one place, instantaneously. So ditch the spreadsheets and all the old software that you've outgrown. Let NetSuite show you how they'll benefit your business with a free product tour at netsuite.com hcm. And now the news. The learning technology business is taking a more holistic approach to learning, and it's offering more functionality from more vendors than it ever has before, according to Red Thread Research. The researcher said COVID-19 and the remote work environment actually allowed many employers to get more users up and running than they'd planned for last year. And it predicts that the remote work dynamic will continue to impact learning ecosystems. The research also found that the overall L&D market has grown in terms of vendors, users, functionality, and revenue. And also, company leaders are more likely to allocate budget toward employee development than they were two years ago. Skillsoft's learning platform, Percipio, now offers blended learning options. In addition to mentoring, live events, and boot camps, customers can now administer their own virtual instructor-led training and instructor-led training programs. This allows companies to provide a single front door for learners, making it easier to discover, register for, and access learning content. DI technology provider Cyndia raised $17.1 million in Series B funding, which was led by Bessemer Venture Partners. The company said increasing demand for its pay equity platform is driving the investment. One reason for that, it said, is that pay equity, increased representation of women and minorities in leadership, and workplace fairness issues have become table stakes for enterprise firms. The company's flagship product, PayEQ, is used by more than 100 firms, to analyze and resolve pay disparities across 2.3 million employees. Canaries, a data collaboration platform that facilitates employer-employee discussions on diversity and inclusion, raised $3 million to expand its technology, hiring, and sales, and its marketing efforts. According to media reports, the investment increases Canaries' funding to date to $4.6 million. The company's technology gathers a variety of company and industry data, and employee reviews to help employers benchmark their performance and identify areas that need improvement. Despite the pandemic and economic downturn, urgent and immediate needs have required many organizations to recruit high volumes of employees. Among employers using high-volume recruitment methods, 40% say the pandemic made them more likely to put such programs in place, reports the HR Research Institute. The report said just 32% of HR professionals strongly believe their companies are good at high-volume recruiting, and most of those at least sometimes use external partners, especially staffing agencies, to meet their goals. The global HR advisory services market looked to be kind of sluggish between 2019 and 2020. It showed a growth rate of just more than 1.1%. COVID was the main reason research and market said, and not surprisingly, All that social distancing, remote work, business closures, and general slowing down were going to act as a break. Still, the slowdown could be temporary. The researcher expects the market to recover and reach a value of about $106.75 billion in 2023. That's a CAGR of 7.1%. Paycor said it's received commitments for $270 million in new investment. The investors include Neuberger Berman, Qatar Investment Authority, Clearbridge Investments, and Franklin Templeton. And finally, Paradox acquired Spets.io, an Israeli messaging platform focused on candidate communications. Founded in 2017, Spets conducts automated chat to handle tasks such as pre-screening and scheduling. That's the news for this week. It was brought to you by NetSuite. Stop paying for multiple systems that don't give you the information you need when you need it. Whether you're doing a million or hundreds of millions of dollars in revenue, save time and money with NetSuite. Join the over 24,000 companies using NetSuite right now. Now's the time to upgrade to NetSuite by Oracle, the world's number one cloud business system. Schedule your free product tour right now at netsuite.com hcm. That's netsuite.com hcm. 
and we're a part of Evergreen Podcasts. To see all of their program, visit www.evergreenpodcasts.com. And to keep up with HR technology, visit the HCM Technology Report every day. We're the most trusted source of news in the HR tech industry. Find us at www.hcmtechnologyreport.com. I'm Mark Pfeffer. Do you love news about LinkedIn, Indeed, Google, and just about every other recruitment tech company out there? Hell yeah. I'm Chad. I'm Cheese. We're the Chad and Cheese Podcast. All the latest recruiting news and insights are on our show. Dripping in snark and attitude. Subscribe today wherever you listen to your podcasts. We We out. The world's best known investor and Wall Street expert Warren Buffett once said, Wall Street is the only place that people ride to in a Rolls Royce to get advice from those who take the subway. Mr. Buffett's quote is remarkably accurate, but how many people would rather receive advice from him than someone simply guessing? Welcome to Buy, Hold, Sell, your single source for Wall Street knowledge and profitable guidance. Please join me, Todd Schoenberger, and fellow trader Tobin Smith, as well as host Veronica Dudo, for a podcast known to move the needle for investors. Tobin and I are seasoned Wall Street executives with deep investment experience, and we are prepared to share our advice to those who choose to listen. Download Buy, Hold, Sell today on the Evergreen Podcast Network or your favorite podcast channel.